Hey guys, Crystal coming on. I'm coming on with some project shares. I've been having some fun. I bought some new dies from Allie and from Amazon. I want to share with you. They're so stinking cute. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm just going to get right into the projects and show you what the dies are and where I got them. This is a little set of panda bears. You know how much I love my pandas. Anyway, I got this on Amazon. Uh, this little Hello Kitty. Uh, I ordered it from Allie. Um, I think it was Art and Life Store. Pretty sure. And I used this um, with uh, the next die that I'm going to show you. I used this little st uh, stamp set that I have in my stash. The little skunk. Uh, which one did I use? Happy Birthday, you little stinker. That's the one I used. And I used it with this cute little um, skunk die that I got off of Amazon. It is so cute. See, bought on Amazon. That's what he looks like. So stinking cute. I will tell you, though, if you want to go buy this skunk, that it does not have the eyes that come with it. You're either going to have to color them in uh, with a white gel pen. And, and I just thought that looked sloppy. So what I did was I found um, some eyes that kind of, in my die stash you know on one of my critters and i ended up using the baby monkey eyes to because it didn't come with the eyes i was so upset about that oh anyway usually these dies come with layering eyes but this one didn't for whatever reason i don't know so hopefully you have some eyes in your stash because he is a cute little fella and you can make him into a girl too i mean it's got a little bow uh, you can you can make it into a girl but i i made him into the just like the the little picture there and then i found this clown on aliexpress that's what it looks like look uh it was art and life store three dollars and 64 cents i'm sure you probably have to add shipping to that too but i love this clown it's so stinking cute i love clowns i think they're cool anyway let's get into my projects first card the pandas isn't that cute you deserve the best day ever. And guys, you want to talk about a simple card? It All you do is cut the dies out in black card stock. Hold on. Cut the dies out in black card stock. Put it on a white base. Glue it down. Done. Easy peasy. And isn't it adorable? Look at those little pandas. They're so cute. And then on the inside, I stamped a little panda with a birthday cake on his head. Isn't that cute? <laughs> anyway. Um, okay, so there's my first card. Like it. And here's that cute little skunk. Look at him. And then I stamped, happy birthday, you little stinker. Isn't he adorable? See, my monkey eyes work pretty good on that skunk, don't they? Cute. He's so cute with his little bow tie and the little tree stump. I love it. And I put some little jimmies on the flowers, colored those with alcohol markers. Um, in the picture, they actually traced his mouth and everything with a marker. I am not comfortable doing that because it gets sloppy and I don't like sloppy. So I didn't do that. I know it would probably show up better. I mean, you can see it embossed up close, but from way down here, it don't look like he has a mouth or anything. But that's the only drawback from the die. Other than that, he's really adorable. And I don't think I did anything on the inside yet. I need to put a layering piece on the inside. But he's cute. Okay. And my clown. Here he comes. Look at him. I made a long slimline card. And I wanted to make it look like a ticket booth. And that the clown was taking the tickets. See, the, I'm going to give you a close-up of the clown. Isn't he so cool? I just love that clown. And he had all the layering pieces, all the pieces for the eyes and everything. He was really simple to put together and really cute. And I had that stamp in my stash. I, I stamped and embossed that in black. And then I colored it in with my alcohol markers. But isn't he adorable? And then I just tried to make it look like a ticket booth. You let me know. Does it look like a ticket booth? I hope so. <laughs> that was the well, that was what I was going for. Oh, okay, but last but not least, let me take the phone down and show you my project with that cute little Hello Kitty. I made a little 
Hello Kitty purse bag. Or actually, it turned out to be a purse box. So hold on, let me take you down. Be right back. Okay, I'm back. Look at that Hello Kitty. Oh my goodness. <laughs> She's so adorable. I love these dyes. Oh my goodness. Like I said, I got her on AliExpress. I think it was um, Art and Life Store, the same store, I think. It could be Panalisa, but I'm pretty sure it's Art and Life Store. But Allie has a ton of Hello Kitty dyes. So, I mean, you could, I mean, she didn't come with the Halloween hat. Uh, the witch's hat or any of that. Um, I used everything else from just my stash, other stuff. I used the purse die, the hocus pocus, um, the little ghost, the bat, the moon, the haunted house, um, the spider even that's hanging from her hat, the hat. All of that was just dies I had in my stash. The only thing I, that came was her. Her and the dress. And, you know, there's a couple of other little pieces with it, I think. Let me see. Let's look at the dot together. Um, yeah, it comes with a little a bow and a flower down there that you can add. Anyway, I think it turned out so cute. And I, instead of just making it a purse, you know what I'm saying? I made a box. So let me see if I can show you. On the inside, the box, the lid opens up like that. And you can put treats inside. So that's what I ended up doing with that. Isn't she precious? I just love her. That is so stinking cute. And then on the back, I put a little, um, some buttons and a zipper. Cute, huh? I didn't want to dress up the back because I wanted to focus on the front because she's just so stinking adorable. I love these dyes. Tell me what you think. Which one of these is your favorite? What you think about my clown? <laughs> what do you think about the skunk? I love the skunk too. Anyway, I'm going to get ready and get off of here. I love you guys. I miss you guys. Let me know what's your favorite. Talk to you later. Bye.